So I'm at 191.8. Welcome to Bodyweight to Bodybuilding, first of all. Today's gonna be a, a, a pretty intense day, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, my cardio this week, I have five days of, check this out, five minutes as hard as possible on the spin bike, and then immediately followed by 20 minutes on the stair stepper as hard as possible. So I'm, 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 I'm like 191.8, that's after I took a shit, because I just took a shit. Can you smell? I'm kidding, I'm kidding. But yeah, this is where I'm at. Like really very really flat this morning. That's okay. Everything is coming in very, very nicely. <sighs> yeah, I'm feeling I'm feeling pretty I'm I'm feeling okay. Um yesterday was just a miserable day, to just to be honest. I had legs. It was just it was just brutal from A to Z. I had legs and then right after I did my cardio and because of my my macros and everything I'm on, so yesterday I was on 150 carb. I was on 50 fat and then 250 protein, so pretty low. And what I'm doing is I'm kind of carb cycling each day. So today I'm at 200 carb, 250 protein, 50 fat. So it switches off and on from the carbs. And then hopefully uh, next week I'm gonna, I'm gonna have some refeeds, but yeah, I am, let's see how many days out I am. I have this board right here. I am 52 days out. So it feels like forever and like it's never ending, but 52 days out, from where I started. I've been prepping for 13 weeks now. So about seven weeks to go. Let's get rolling. I'm gonna eat and then get right into the workout. My greens and my creatine HCL. So we're finally coming out with our creatine HCL. Look how dope this bottle looks. It's freaking amazing. But um, as you guys know, I literally take this every single day. I'm gonna roll some reviews really quick. Brrr, boom. Yeah. The greens are freaking selling like wildfire. People love them and we have a lot of people joining on them. I'm going to eat, let me just show you what I'm gonna eat as well. So I take this every single morning. I'm gonna have my vitamin B12. I'm also gonna have my vitamin C. Food. I don't know if you guys have ever had buffalo sauce before. <laughs> Stupid question. This is literally, hands down, my favorite buffalo sauce because it's only 15 calories for one tablespoon. I like to put it on pretty much everything. One carb and 0.5 fat. I have this with so many different meals. It's noble made by the new primal medium buffalo dipping and wing sauce. So I'm putting this on a cauliflower. I got this on a, on a cauliflower thin crust and about 4.15 ounces of ground turkey meat before my workout. Dude, go try it. Go buy it right now. Like, go, oh. Woo! Okay, so Wednesday, which means I'm not going too intense at the same time, I do want it to be intense enough for specific movements. So I'm doing overhead press. Up. Actually, that's my time right there. One minute rest, five sets, and then I'm gonna do a little bit of chest, upper chest. Remember, I focus a little bit more than anything. Today we're hitting a little bit more shoulders. Cause I'm afraid of what's gonna come out Life is but a dream This can't be happening Wake up, wake up, scream I'm in Done. That was five sets of five. 60 second rest, so working a little bit more on my muscular endurance. Can you remember, hypertrophy training is really a minute to two minutes, so we're right on that cusp of like really focusing on building size, but also with the volume, a little less reps. So generally, it's like eight to 12 or seven, so I like to say six to 12 for hypertrophy. Decent size, volume, lower rest, feeling good. All right, let's keep rolling.
That's all we got. Nothing too crazy. Kind of my Wednesdays are a little bit more lax. I have a call for about an hour and then I'm gonna get into my cardio. So you're gonna see that. It's brutal. Five minutes of, on the spin as hard as possible. 20 minutes on the stair stepper as hard as possible. Generally once I'm done, when I wanna throw up, two I'm just beat to the bone. I feel depleted, honestly. Where I'm at, you can see why I feel depleted. I'm just so lean. So, let's get this cardio. minute some just keep it consistent I like to really work myself to point of exhaustion so let's see how conditioned I am baby there's a lot of talking out there not people. I'm working hard. 40 minutes on a stair step. Whatever the fuck it's called. Oh, I do this, I do that. I built this. What the fuck do you actually do? Show them the real shit. 20 minutes as hard as possible. Five minutes, bike as hard as possible. Last minute, full max. I'm on a fucking beach right now. This shit's easy work. Boom. Easy. Breathe through the nose. I've never shown anybody on my YouTube how conditioned I can actually get. And this isn't just from a day or two, or a month, or a year or two. 13 years. Hell yeah. Let's have a good rest of the day, shall we? Okay, back home, about to eat. Got some Icon meals cooking up. If you have not purchased this yet, I'm not even kidding, this protein cookie butter powder. Look at these macros. 50 calories for two tablespoons, that's 15.7 grams. You get one gram of fat, four grams of carbs, and eight grams of protein. I actually have um, a little bit left over from earlier, and all you do is you put a little bit of water in it, and it actually is like usually like this thick, like up to here where my thumb is. You put a little bit of water in it, you put it in the freezer for about 10 minutes, and then you eat it with something small, and it's like a, this is literally a cheat code. I'm actually gonna be going over some cheat codes here soon, so I don't want to give you too much information, but it's time to eat. If you eat right, you feel right, you feel right, you look right, you look right, you do right, yeah, you dig. So I'm eating, how many ounces of cod? Six ounces of cod, four ounces of roasted sweet potato, and then that's four ounces of broccoli, but I put this buffalo sauce on. I told you guys, I'm literally in love with this stuff, and I'm eating it every single day. Don't judge me. If you have not, I'm telling you, if you have not picked up the wing sauce, if you have not picked up the protein cookie butter, and you have not picked up your Icon meals, I, I highly suggest you do. Just do it, trust me. Protein cookie butter, I believe it, it like sells out pretty quickly. I would get the Oreo, the Oreo is the best. I'm not like a huge fan of the one that I just had. I definitely love it. And then Icon meals, they have a lot of signature meals that are pretty expensive, and you don't have to worry about time. You put it in the microwave for three minutes, and you're good to go. That's all it takes, so yeah. I'm giving you these tips, take them. And I'll stick to create you greens. Create you show. All right, bye. Yeah, this guy's hat right here. 
is freaking cool. Look at that. Looks like uh, the Crocodile Dundee. Is that what it is? Wow, look at that fast bike. This is what we do all day, guys. We just creep on people. Like, oh, what are you doing down there, brother? Oh, hello, sister. You want to go on a date, ma'am? Hey, dude. <laughs> the Rockers are losing. So. They're, they're, they're freaking losing? Yeah. They're down too bad. Seriously? Seriously. Seriously? How serious are you right now? Dead ass. Okay, <laughs> cool. Edits, baby. Edits! Quick tip, bananas. You should buy a bunch of bananas, as you can see, a lot of them. You wait until they're really, really ripe. I think that's what it means, right? <laughs> ripe. When they're good to eat, or they're the most nutritious. You take them all off, and then you simply put them in bags. So you cut them up, you put them in bags, and you store them in the freezer, and then you can use them for all of your smoothies. This is like a super, super easy way to make your smoothies taste that much better. It's a different consistency whenever you freeze something. And, and that's actually, it's a huge difference, trust me. Whenever you get something from a, like a local store or restaurant or whatever, and uh, you wonder why like, it just tastes so much different than the smoothies at home, a lot of it is the way they treat all of their vegetables and fruits. Freezing is one of them. Oh, I wanna eat it so bad, but I can't. Macros, baby. <laughs> we back, we back for some food, baby, let's ride! We got some rice cauliflower blend. Wow. With roasted sweet potato and kale. And then we have the, oh, he's posing. Oh shit. Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> uh, and then, yeah, so this is what it looks like. All of it, it's freaking amazing. Put it on medium. I got some shrimp heating up in here. And then I also got Brussels sprouts. Oh, oh, oh. Dude. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> you get <getting> nervous? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is it really? Yeah, it looks like it's done. Is that fucked up? Just dying on camera real quick. I was gonna keep it rolling to make sure we got the shot. I'm like, yo, let's get the shot. You're All like right. choking, you're like. <laughs> Alright, All right, let me show you the final, the final recipe here. Look at that meal, baby. Wow. And of course I have my freaking addiction over here, medium buffalo, with every meal. Somebody call the cops. Somebody call the cops, brother. <laughs> I'm also watching Nick Strength and Power, and he's talking about couple things. One of them was The Rock and how he's going to be hosting a, what is it? Convention? Like IFBB bro? Uh, IFBB. Bodybuilding show. Bodybuilding show. Like prize money, being higher. Look, if The Rock does anything, he will surpass literally anything. He has star power. Like, and that's not even just star power. It's like major star power. You know, people have heard about the Olympia. A lot of people haven't heard about the Olympia. If The Rock talked about the Olympia, people would hear about the Olympia and they'd be like, yo, I want to be a part of that. Oh, I want to go or something like that. This man just needs to show up in places and everyone starts running over. So is it a good idea? Fuck yeah, it's a good idea. I think it's an amazing idea. Um, I think you should partner with me to be honest and I should take about 51%. But uh, <laughs> no, but I think this is going to be pivotal in the industry if he does go through with it. And it is a very, very big IFBB Pro show just because it's, it's fitness. Everyone know he's, knows he's jacked. And if he competed and if he won, he knows this, damn. <laughs> no, but... Yeah, I wish him nothing but no luck. Just nothing but the best, and I would love them. Any way I could be a part of that, would love it. I'm here at Co Reed's Barbershop. Sorry if I'm not, I don't have too much energy right now. I'm a little tired, it's been a long day. Let's do this prep. Just another day, another dollar though. I was actually looking at this plaza for I can't tell you. My boy Nick is in there. Best barber alive, man. I'm about to get freshy freshy. Actually, you know what? I want to show you like a little, put a little dope edit together, yeah? Again, what a bing bada boom. All right, haircut. So right, so right, so right. I'm just going with the gut. Never had a doubt, felt like this is just a must. Put me in perspective, I'm the deepest in the cut. Everybody tuning in, but this is just for us now. We know I ain't ballin' yet. Hoes wanna holler, oh no, I don't call them back. Girl, let me see you hold it down, we gon' have a blast. Cause I just wanna know what you gonna do with all of that. I ain't gotta say a word, I know what's up. You can have it all. Watch me whip it all. Fresh cut? Freshy. Yo, what's up? Look at that. Damn. Alright, dinner. 
Here it is. Three eggs, three and a half ounces of zucchini, about two ounces of cherry tomatoes in the air fryer, ground turkey, 4.1 ounces. And we also have a nice batch of hash browns, but these hash browns are a little bit different. They're from Cascadia Farm, Cascadian Farms, I think. And they're, this is only 200 calories. So the whole whole thing, 52 carbs. So for hash browns, it's amazing. They don't they don't cook it with like oil or anything. So I'm gonna edit here. Thanks for tuning in for another episode. Coming down to the wire, coming close. You know, I'm I'm gonna work as hard as I can on posing here soon, and I'm just gonna keep on eating the way I am, and uh, and doing cardio and, and training at the level I am. And a lot of people have been have been messaging me saying, oh, what what are you on? Like what tests, whatever. Guys, I'm prepping for a show. Like I wasn't even training before I started this. So I've been anabolic, I've been building a lot of muscle and losing fat at the same time. So really inspiring uh, to hear people even say anything like that because that means that I'm growing, which is really cool. So thanks for tuning in for that episode. Comment down below, subscribe if you haven't already. Also, Create You Nutrition, link is in the description. If you want creatine HCL or uh, the Create You Greens, they're both gonna be in the description. The creatine HCL has officially launched, so I'll definitely pick yours up. And uh, yeah, podcast every Tuesday and Friday. Don't forget about that, that's also in the description. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you next time. Peace! So right, so right, so right. I'm just going with the gut. Never had a doubt, felt like this is just a must. Put me in perspective.